Well, concerns here at home tonight after a teenager used a semi automatic rifle to kill 17 people at a Florida high school. We have heard now from some of you wondering what's being done to keep our kids safe. KXY 4's Ariana Lake working for you to bring us answers about security measures at Spokane schools. Ariana? Well, the superintendent, pardon me, the director of campus safety tells me that millions have already been pumped into local schools to keep kids safe, and some of what they do is influenced by shootings that happened around the nation. It's been one day since a teenager opened fire at a Florida high school, killing 17 people. Since then, Spokane County School District Director of Campus Security, Mark Sturk, has been analyzing what happened. We critique each and every one of these events. Uh, we want to look at where maybe some of the failures were and so that we can improve our systems and not have to experience the same thing. You can see the safety measures already in place at North Central High School, a secure single point of entry. Visitors have to get buzzed in by the office staff. Security cameras and badge passes, but even those can't stop everything. Just last week at this school, a man somehow got in, wandered around and stole from students. The district believes he came in during an event or a student let him in, probably not knowing the man didn't belong there. That's another reason Sturk believes one of the most useful tools are the school resource officers. He encourages students to build a relationship with them. In the Florida incident, those kids knew. They were talking about it afterwards. We knew he was going to do this. We felt like he was going to do this. Those are the kinds of things that we want the kids to come forward and feel free to share with their resource officer. And those are the kinds of things Spokane school leaders learn from other tragedies across the nation. Sturk says school security is and will remain a top priority in Spokane. The school district has invested $4 million over the last three years to put systems in place to keep our kids and staff safe. Um, so the district has not taken it lightly. It's been a big investment. Sterk tells me the conversation also centers around mental health, and he told me that there are resources available for students to use locally if they do need that mental health. Reporting from North Central High School, Ariana Lake, KXLY 4 News. Nadine. Th thank you, Ariana.